Make a lot of noise for Karen Hamlin! Thank you, thank you. Oh my goodness, it feels great to be here because I got a five month old at home. Just any excuse to get out of the house is amazing. Uh, it's been a crazy learning experience with having a child, like having a child, that, there's a lot of stuff they don't tell you before you have a kid. Like uh, if you're dark skinned, for instance, your baby might be born with little to no melanin. Okay, so you don't know what melanin is, okay. For y'all that don't know what melanin is, uh, melanin is what makes good basketball players. That's... You see why I was confused? <laughs> so my wife is having this baby and the baby is born. She holds the baby and she was like, oh my goodness, babe, look what we created. And now I'm emotional, I'm crying, I wipe my eyes, and I look down at this baby and I was like, that's not my baby. <laughs> I was like, whose Puerto Rican baby is this, man? I was walking around the hospital with him like he was a messed up order at McDonald's. <laughs> excuse me, uh, excuse me nurse, this ain't my order. Uh, I order light ketchup, no mayo, and a black baby. This is... <laughs> Another thing you gotta do, you gotta do a two week checkup. So our doctor meets us for the first time and he's super confused when he meets us cause our last name is Hamlet. So a couple of y'all's got it already. Uh, we don't look like a Hamlet family, y'all. <laughs> this is, we, that's Shakespearean white. Uh, we're Wakanda black. Like if you, so he meets us, he's like, he plays it up, he's like, nice to meet you, Mrs. Hamlet, nice to meet you, Mrs. Hamlet. And he looks down at our baby, and it was like, oh my goodness, what a beautiful baby. He turns over and looks at us, he's like, how great for you guys to adopt this Puerto Rican baby. That is so... <laughs> and I'm scared to raise like a young black man in America, like a, a young black child, and it's, it's terrifying though. And it's, cause I'm, I'm black, y'all. But I'm not like black, black. Like, do you know? All right, so I lost y'all, okay. So I'm black, but I'm not like BET black. Like, do you know? What I'm trying to explain is I play Magic the Gathering is what I'm trying to explain to you guys right now. Thank you, thank you. Much more supportive than my brother was. <laughs> he got mad, he was like, bro, really? Magic? Magic? I was like, yo, calm down, bro. Black people do everything now. Black people can do everything. I think there's at least two of us that can swim now, I think. <laughs> Fuck you guys for laughing at that. <laughs> <laughs> so I got mad. I was like, yo, put your money where your mouth is, man. Let's make a bet. Let's make a $50 bet. I shook his hand, we made a bet. I went home that night. I went to Craigslist in the group section and I was like, black magic meetup. <laughs> It was just a lot of mad witches, y'all. Like, I lost a hundred dollars that night. I also found out I was the Jackie Robinson of Magic the Gathering. So that was, I was the first black magic player. If y'all didn't get that joke, it's fine. Let's turn to a history lesson real quick. And I hate my twin brother. I, I hate my twin brother and it's not his fault because my dad raises us to hate each other from birth. And that sounds confusing, but my dad named my brother Kenneth, right? My dad's name is Kenneth, right? My name is Ken Dale. Like, do you see where they messed up at, y'all? Like, I've been living my whole life as off-brand cereal. And I just want to be Cocoa Puffs too, Dad. That's it. Any rela relationships? I'm, I've, been, I've been in a relationship for, for nine years with my current wife. Nine years we've been together, and I hate when I come to comedy shows and I see comics talk trash about relationships, because like relationships are beautiful. They say stuff like when you're in a relationship, you're not happy anymore, or the, the main thing they say is when you get married, you don't fuck no more. And that's a lie, y'all. Married people be fucking. It's the truth, we be fucking. We be fucking fighting. 
You was a fucking idiot. That's not my fucking baby. Like, Jesus. <laughs> All right, I've been Ken Hamill. Y'all been great. Ladies and gentlemen, huge round of applause for Ken.